all right i have these two real packs here um we're not going to do a prediction on these we're just going to open up these because there's there's nothing we can do out of these except get you know super bowl cards so i don't expect us to pull any of the new cards out of these so but the only thing we can get out of here is 95s so the star elites and the pro max fantasy pack the other ones yes you may get a good good pull but like they're based off of old pro programs so like we got a 95 chat 95 chase young okay Usually they so they haven't condensed it yet. Ninety one. Oh, I just opened up a Star Elite pack on accident. Chat. My bad. The big three packs are left: Playmakers, Pro Max, Star Elites. We're looking for a ninety three plus out of fifty two Playmakers. We're looking for a ninety three plus out of fifty. I mean, we start off with a ninety one as a W. That's a definitely def did they take playmakers out of store? Why would I get Tyreek? He's a midget. So many people get 98, 99 speed. 92 John Mackey. Okay. Okay. Cook. Mmm. I had juice in the other two Josh Allen's. I wasn't take either one of the Josh Allen's. Because they're Juice is the only one who's the best at his position. Josh Allen's not the best quarterback, and the other Josh Allen's not the best rusher. So, I mean, why couldn't that have been a quick sale? That would have been great, but like, Ty, y'all gotta understand, Tyreek's speed doesn't make him special anymore. When I can get six three, six four receivers to ninety eight, ninety nine speed. Unfortunately, that's the problem. Tyreek is always good at the beginning of the year, but the latter part of the year, Tyreek cards absolutely suck just because everyone can get speed Josie 386 appreciate the follow all right our playmakers have been kind of ass thus far not even gonna lie our highest pull out of a playmaker actually they haven't been too bad we got in a 92 so 86 cook 92 christian gonzalez all right okay gank a 89 now i believe chat the playmakers are what 87 plus is that right i think the playmakers are 87 plus i'm pretty i'm pretty yeah they have to be 87 plus because i think I mean, but we're looking for a 93. We haven't got one yet, so. Or 88 plus. Well, the overgang is a 93 plus if we pull one, but. Could be one here. It's probably like an 87, though. 88 Uncle Shay Shay. Yeah, chat. I've still yet to pull a full legend, though, which is kind of disheartening. Full AKA. JJ does, right? 94. Pastronaut. Bang, bang, over, gang. Mm. So we stopped and made another prediction because we got the 93. We got 37 playmakers left. 94 plus out of 37 playmakers. 67% is on the over. 33% is on the under. Let's get it. Now, in fairness, we did already pull a 95 out of our Super Bowl packs. So, you know, are we going to continue to cook? That's a 90. We'll take a 90. 90s are good because you can make 93s. And 93s obviously make combine players and stuff. Redux. I have yet to pull a 95. Or a 96 Redux. Sorry, I did pull a 95. Uh, What's his name? Pouncey from the Steelers. I guess it depends on what you're doing a shopping spree for. That's what it depends on. Gang gang! 93. Nope. This is it. at least like an 88, I think. Yep. All right. 
I mean, if you're buying them for your team or are you buying them just to invest, like what are you buying them for? I mean, if you're a 93, you should just be, personally, this could be a 93. I would just be trying to stack my coins, not upgrade my team. Unless you can get cards at a good price. And there, if if you had, so anytime, anytime a market crash is about to happen, right? What you need to do, you need to look at the cards you want and you need to put down a price point you're comfortable paying with. So if there's a specific 95 you were looking at, and let's say if this 95 gets to 160K, I'm buying it. If you see that 95 at like 170, maybe you pull the trigger on it. That's anytime I go into a shopping spree, that's what I go about. I say, look, I want this card at this price. If I see this card at this price, good morning. If I see this card at this price, I'm going to buy it. Redux? It's Ron Armstead. Disgusting. Oh, chat, that scared the crap out of me. It's a Kanban player. Freak. I mean, I don't know why you would bet a 94 plus on these, but... I mean, for us to already get a 94, I feel like these are already cooked. I don't expect to get another 94, but... I don't know if there's going to be a market crash because the Team of the Year cards aren't that desirable. I mean, I think the lower... There's a 93 chat, but that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for a 94. We are looking for a 94. The market only crash if the high-end cards are desirable. Now, mind you, free agency could be next week. So I think next week we do get... A, a, this week wouldn't be a bad time to snipe 94s if 94s get down to like 100K. Snipe hunt 94s, then pr prepare for... Uh, What's that? Uh, free agency next week. Because I do think free agency next week will go back to 594s require. Who's better to sell? I mean, you got to check their price. I don't know their price. Whatever price you, you're comfortable buying, Kyle, at. Like, y'all got to understand the price is the price. We can't control the price. <coughs> so at the end of the day, it's whatever you feel comfortable buying a specific card at. At the, if you feel comfortable buying two million on a zero pick art, a zero deep out, then do it. I think I will say this. I would I think Kyle Hamilton is probably one of the better LTDs in terms of being expensive. Like I think Kyle Hamilton at his price is better than what Cam Chancellor was at his price, if that makes sense. I assume when you say Kyle, you're talking about Kyle Hamilton and not Kyle Usechek. It's a 91. Hmm. W pack. I mean, these haven't been bad, chat. We just haven't got the big 94 pool that we're looking at, you know, the looking for. So this could be a 96, but it also could be a 90. So we've gotten two 93s out of these 37 packs. You got a team of the year PS2 for 438. That's not, I'm still going to rock the 96 overall PS2 because I prefer them in the slot. Because they're better, like P, the PS2 team of the year is going to be an outside corner where the Nike run PS2, excuse me, is going to be a slot corner. And I prefer them to have a slot corner than um, an outside corner. There's enough outside corners right now. Not many. There's not too many slot corners that get pick artists and all that stuff for free. Yeah, like 91. Y'all got to remember, 91s in these packs are a break. So anytime I pull a 91 out of these packs, I'm breaking even. In any of these packs. Because remember, I opened up all these packs with the training I got at around 30K. 30K. My family is awake. Twitter is saying open. I'm not opening up mystery packs, bro. I understand why Twitter is saying open up mystery packs. Because there's there's going to be a make right for them. The issue is the make right's not going to be that good. Like you're going to be getting make right ganky packs and all that. Yes, it's going to be free packs. I get that. If you have training to waste, absolutely do it. But I, I don't have training to waste. So I'm not actively going out and buying training just to rip mystery packs. Like, 
like absolutely it's there should be a make right with the mystery packs but you got to remember you're going to be spending training so i mean i guess if you want if you have mystery tra like i said if you have training to waste sure go do it but like for me yeah if that makes sense god we're pulling a lot of those Angry runs. Highest this would be is a 93. All right, chat. I think we're it's a GG's. I think it is a GG's. We didn't get a 94. It's 6 30 in the morning here. Last pack magic. We did not make it happen. That's okay. <laughs> 